Prepare for battle. Up on a series that could go either way, one thing is almost guaranteed. No, in fact, I will guarantee you it. At the end of this, one team will have won 2 1. Alright, that's my that's my prediction. Yeah, here. Look at this. <laughs> Tiger! He's gonna fall first. GH afterwards. They really want to get that advantage from the monkey king. But Nigma get a little bit more. Maybe they get more out of this though. Mike is a nice tight step of the LSA. They're moving in with the Tevin. Saini in trouble. Has got the fairy fire to get out. Boxy, these calls are stacking up. He's gonna find the kill of Mind Control. Koi forgets it. He gets the double kill, in fact. And he'll turn to Kuro. Boxy will fall. But it's gonna be another one going the way of Koi. But Mikkei actually snatches it away. What is this blood sport? Good lord. Six kills. And we haven't even seen runes yet. Yeah. Action. Blood! Let's go. Nah, snap fire. Will he get the snap up the victory, or will he get fired and fried by the sleep? The battle Not the begins. mid lane, though, however, because this is tight lane Lina by Weeha. No, this Opting is... to put this... Wait, this is also a snap this is fire the side new... by... <laughs> yeah, this is the new mid lane. This is, this is some... Uh, this, these are some <laughs> lane swapping shenanigans already we see. I don't think we've I don't think we've once seen Mikke or oh, I haven't at least we haven't cast uh, Snapfire. I'm sure he's done it, but usually he he takes this in the mid lane, right? He doesn't play it in the outer lanes. No, I haven't really seen the position one side lane Snapfire. I, I haven't seen much yet, but I, I think these lanes they should be quite good for Liquid. I think he can do okay against Dusa uh, once you get a couple levels, you know, put a couple levels in that primal dance, uh, primal swing. <laughs> Usa can get annoyed here by the orb of eventually. Yeah, she's already a giant slug and 275 movement speed. Boots won't even deal with the, the oof for you. You'll still be chased down it. Unless you're right next Radiant's to your tower, quick throw is almost always guaranteed to get the, the Jingu. Yeah, the good thing for Nygma here, they've got this timber against the bristle. Now, this matchup, early levels, this can be a little bit annoying for timber saw, but it does get better. The goo, of course, is, is kind of annoying. Fox already being on. He might get this. And with this. He's going. Mango, does this man have? <laughs> Too many. He's got a lot of mangoes, man. Yeah, he's like. A I, lot of mangoes. He's like, you. why am I being forced away? I didn't finish. I still got four more mangoes to digest it. Come on. By the way, this, folks, this is how you play play a bristleback. Uh, yeah, I've seen many failing bristlebacks over the bumps, and most of them never level Nasal Goo. This spell is so underrated on this here. Yeah, the, the value point, the base armor loss, it starts at two. So the first point you get the incredibly valuable spell to have. Also, when you're against the Timber, I think you have to get the no way or otherwise. Oh, GH. Early rotation on the Quaifa. He's going to be punished for this. He could not get the Jingu. Balance Strike won't save him either as the final tap comes out from GH. Nicely anticipated by the Earth Spirit. Yeah, and the, the fact is the Tiger can't really... I mean, he's not really in a position to, to all that much to Viha right now. Uh, top lane is going to be pretty good for Liquid, but, uh, you know, just bringing up this rotation, uh, this is how you offset this map. Bring the, this rotation from the, from the Earth Spirit and... and Make the monkey not as happy early on. Yeah, this isn't really a hero right now that, that feels comfortable from behind. Usually you pick it because you kind of get an advantage and then just start to rotate, right? There, right? It's, it's always been the way Monkey King has functioned. Hence why half the time people have this whole idea that the Monkey King is a completely broken hero. Yeah, you gotta shut him down a bit first. Otherwise he can get the pop off. Top end. Popping off for kills on the Wii. Rotation on point. GH not able to save the day. In fact, GH in trouble himself. He, he hasn't got the roll. I, well, he's dead. Yep. Final tap will come out. Could not escape. Nicely done by Tiger. Facilitate both those kills. Yeah, I think uh, lane is, is oh, very strong. Man. This uh, liquid lane. They've got these all these spells like the Snapfire, Cookie, the Blast, all tiny spells. They have a ton of damage. A lot of disable as well. Yeah. Gun again. He only just got back. 
That's going to be a walk of shame. No boots either, so it's going to take we some time to arrive again. And I mean, Liquid, they're coming out aggressive. Even this bot lane, they almost have killed both members of Nikla so far. The quills are not getting any easier to deal with, not even for mind control. Now, yeah, are we? No, he's not. Yeah, he's going to do this. Uh... Okay, okay. Play it that way. <laughs> we are going to do, like you said, the walk of shame. Got the fiery soul, you know, he's... Uh... At least he's at the the triple three move speed. I could do Quick this though day. with the completed treads. Uh, might get a little bit scary for Miracle if he missteps. Yeah, it's just the, the lane is so short, right? Like if you think of, of older iterations, mid felt like like you could easily catch someone out, right? But there's not a lot of real estate to run down even a slow hero like like the Medusa in this meta in this iteration of the map. Nah, it's it's not it's not all that simple. You can't play the high ground fight. You can retreat into the jungle. Hit some pre push the lane, hit some pre Prince repeat. <laughs> I love this from Tiger. He's like, no, GH, you get hit by creeps. GH like, no, you get hit by creeps. They just want to get ready for this rune. They're probably oh nice. GH, he will be blocked on the rollout. He at least sidesteps the cookie. GH is going down. Tiger gets the kill. We is at least able to collect the bounty though. However, Tiger. Yeah, we did see in the first game there where Tiger was a early, early tiny now off to an equally good start. It's not better. Already at 600 gold, level 4. Ready to bring the pain. Very ridiculous. I mean, both the boss fours in game one had a phenomenal performance. So far, both of them find a little bit of relevance. But GH, even though you got that really good kill on mid, already three deaths in on this ball of left. <laughs> It's just this, this pressure just keeps coming up. Kiss in the top lane. We, I fought her some regurgitate. Mike hits the level six and hits the kill. We is having a brutal game. Four deaths now already on the Lena. Yeah, he was level three and Snapfire was six. Ah, uh, this. This uh, this is quite worrisome for. Oh, it's getting worse. Enigma. It's getting worse. GH, they're blocking his rollout. He's just gone. Liquid, they're fishing for kills, and they're coming up gold every time. <laughs> I don't even know how you deal with me, K. Now, maybe if you rotate the three heroes in top up here, so, you know, you got like a tri lane going. But even then, I, I wouldn't be surprised if they're the ones finding kills when you consider how squishy both the AA and the Lena are. Lena's uh, incredibly scary for them. Oh, there so you have some stacks here. Boxy. Yep. Mind control misses with the... The old there. He just wants out and now. Boxy with the region still running. He's just he's going. He's gonna keep chasing this. Uh, Quakefish coming in. I think they they may have him. Like he could go for a TP, but now that Quakefish here, there's no chance because he's got the boundless. He'll at least find the kill onto the IO. But with the arrival of the Monkey King, mind control is going down. Nice. Liquid are they are off to a very good start here. I just. I just love this whole series. Like, honestly, this has been one of the most aggressive series consistently we've had. It's more aggression is happening in the top lane. Mike tries to cookie out. They will not get the cold. No, he turns around to give the cold feed. Io is there, however, to save. He's going to heal him up. GH now in trouble. They toss the two supports together. Kuro being chased down by Tiger. He's got the boots. The cold feed will not proc. And instead, it's going to be the ancient apparition likely to fall here. He does get the kill. Stun out on Insane. He roll in. The cookies not there. Yeah, but the kisses are GH taking a lot of damage. Avalon toss the combo a triple kill for me. Insane is alive. Very clutch place by Liquid. The uh, great rotation by Insania saving Mickey there. Don can't connect because uh, Mickey is fast with the the IO coming in to help him out. He just gets to walk it off. They bring it back around with them. I tell you, Grandma's been doing Pilates here because Mika, I mean, 508. All right, there's nothing slow about this old lady and her dragon. That, he's just completely destroying this game for Nigma right now. And that we see Miracle deliver exactly that. Some miracles in the past, but when even the monkey can look at Quake for now, being at the top of the net worth chart, and this bristle feeling pretty cozy, there's a concern that Liquid might be able to play fast enough that this Medusa's game becomes incredibly uncomfortable. Yeah, and I also, I don't even know who's had the time to do all this stacks for Liquid. I feel like they, they've got ancient stacks, they've got a bunch of stacks in the camps, 
they're finding these kills. Uh, they're playing this lineup. Uh, Dyer's bottom I mean, it's, it's under attack. Much as good as it gets. It's one of the best things for Martha right now. Like in the latest part of this patch, it's the thing we always talk about. It's stacking and GH. They stack a lot of damage on him. Not able to finish him off. But there's never a turnaround. That, that's the problem, right? This double strength lane feels so hard to be into that, especially if we not even having six yet, there's never a chance to punish them for doing these attempts. Yeah, Nigma are gonna, they're gonna be banking seriously on this dude. I mean, he doesn't even have the same amount really of, of stacks that he did in that previous. No, he, he doesn't have a support cast either. Amazing start. The LSA will connect. We're still on level 6 though. The cookie to turn around and get a kill instead. It's quick for side steps. Both feet will go off, but the kiss is again Mike. Just completely destroying them. A double kill. You think Lena would have better resistance to fire, but not dragon fire. Not this dragon. Yes. Six. Page 1 and 6, this top lane combined the uh, 1 and 12. Uh, I mean, quite the disastrous start. It is. I mean, now it's it getting more support. Yeah. 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 yeah, everyone's struggling. Look at mind control. He got baited into this attempt to kill Boxy. No, Boxy not only gets the kill, he's going to be able to just continue to farm this area. They get the runes as well. They're hunting on the Mika. He's worth a crap ton of gold. Tiger knows it. Nice toss back to slow the pursuit. He knows he's going to die. It'll give over a little bit of gold, but imagine the amount of money they would have got if they found that snap bar. He finds the double damage. Of course. He's uh, starting to work on that axe. Gotta get this dude up. Big. Faster, somehow, you know? <laughs> somehow. Make, uh, make, make gold worth more. Boxy? Well, the only gold that's gonna happen is the, the gold of liquid going up. Miracle, they try to bat him away. It's a little one that's not very good at getting out of that boulder smash. They'll hunt under the tower. The gaze will come out. Boxy needs to turn around. Taking a lot of damage here. The cold feet's gonna prop. It stones up mobile here. It's here. Cooking to get in, but Boxy is down. Avalanche on the free. The toss in. The turn. Tiger gets the double kill. Kuro chased on two next. One more hit would end his life, but Mike will find it. And GH, he needs to get out quick. The scatter blast is coming off cooldown. They could go for the toss forward. He's renewing the magnetite, but Mike is hunting for it. He interrupts the roll. He gets it. It's a double kill for Mike. Now 9 0 10 at the 11 minute mark on this snap fire. This is a master class in the Dragon Master itself, as we is also going down. It's a triple kill for Mike. Oh my. 10 0 10 at 11 minutes. Radiance middle tower is under attack. Uh, Liquid are they're putting on a show. Uh, we use the term beat down a lot. I don't think this Radiance does it justice. I mean, this this goes beyond a beat down. It's a 7,000 net worth lead pre 12 minutes for Liquid. Radiance Koikwa top is, tower is under Koikwa attack. is somehow also the top net worth here. Not Mickey with the 10 0 10. Yeah. Koikwa is actually the top here. He's gonna finish his axe into gold. And then, of course, you farm even faster with that, right? And you also got the Ironwood Tree, which, I mean, it's it's risky, but with this hero, it allows you to just move through areas that otherwise you'd have to weave around, right? Mighty scary. They need a solution soon, but right now, all they can do, the best they can do is, is dodge. This is the thing about their draft, it's the weakness, right? It's like the only one who could maybe sell kills is we, and, and I think saying he got shut down is an understatement. Even gonna take these stacks from Miracle. Oh no. They also have the, you know, if, if the previous 12 and a half minutes, I think this was an 11 minute blink dagger on Taiga. Good. Not only that, Foxy, I think he is going for a Heaven's Halberd. Which means Medusa. You're screwed. In the, in the, in the, at least for the next few fights, you need a way of buying a serious time if you're Nigma. Okay, he's going for the defuse. Is not going to get easier. Uh, it's not getting easier anyway. Here. All the way back. He gets the stone gaze out. The blast is coming through, but they sidestep it. They've got kisses coming off cooldown, so Miracle needs to be faster than this to escape. GH is guarding him, but Boxy is hunting. Gets a whiff of weakness. He will strike. Tiger? Looking for something. 
He can't find it though. Mind control's not the kill, and he knows it. He respects the fact that Mech makes him a bit too tangy. No, he doesn't. He goes in now. Avalanche toss back. Wukong's down. Cookie control is good. Timbo is pretty much done. The balance strike clips on a miracle, which means Boxy has to go to dive. The kisses are coming through. They're going to slow him up. Under the tier 2 tower they go. Boxy level 10. More than tanky enough to keep pursuing this. Our man or a miracle. The reinitiation with Tiger gets the kill. We is going to be brought down as well. Timbo to make sure they can keep on going. They're diving tier 3 at 14 minutes into the game, and Boxy's not done. He's going to look for one more. He might actually finally be punished for this. He'll go for the TP out. The roll is going to be there, though. Relo will get him out just in time. And when he comes back, I don't think you can. You have to leave him be. This is now Boxy's base. No, Mortimer, it's not playtime. Not that sort. Does he change? Oh, no. The roll out of him. Okay, they're going to respect it. They say, wait, mind control might be a problem. <laughs> Let, let's not jump the gun here. We only just got the tier one tower. I don't... Liquid are there. Or... So when did you last see something. Nygma? So when did you last see Nygma get beat down this hard? I mean, I, I don't... I, I can't really remember the, the last time I saw anyone. <laughs> Game at such a deficit at this, uh, at this minute. This feels like a Hail Mary smoke. It does connect on the right target though. Insania gets caught. That is the kill they need. Maybe the only one they can get right now. But it will deter Boxy. It will force him to leave. And then actually, he's not even going for the Heaven Hell, but he's going for the, the Sanjin Yasha. I don't know if that's the kill they need. I think that's the kill that they get. They get the position 5 IO with, I think that was like a 4 or 5 man smoke. Hey man, you said they, they needed money. That's the only kill they get. <laughs> I think they'll take whatever they're given right now. It's the beginning, Pycat. If they can do that 10 more times without losing a single hero, we might have a to comeback. Be fair, to be fair, we did see back from a... I think it was like a 30k deficit the other day. That's true, but so can if, they... If can... anything, if anything, you know, it's possible. I, I do think this game might be just even... That that bit harder, but the... Yeah, where's, the, where's their ability to backdoor in this game, right? <laughs> They just want to force a reaction out of it. Like, Fox, he, he's got enough that all he needs to do for the rest of the game is create space, and he's doing exactly that. They have no way to contest it. We now in too deep. They realize it straight away. Tiger jumps in. He turns one into two. As Quake for a rise to clean him up. Everywhere Nigma go, it, they just feel like headless chickens, and it's not for any fault of their own. It's just Liquid are making them sweat. Foxy just, uh, just like here. Yeah. Making it so difficult to land any of these spells, just shooting cold, shooting thuns. So this, this, this right here is it, this Lion King, right? Foxy, he's talking to his Fancy father. Fancy footwork. Fancy footwork, you know. I mean, it's the case he can go wherever he wants, right? Like everything he sees belongs to him. The only place which is off limits is the fountain. Wait for he's gonna fight. Wukong's down, he's got the axe of course. The ice blast is gonna fly through, but if he just walks this off, he's gonna be fine. Mind control trying to re-engage, but the trees are in the way. They work against him. While that's happening, we is gonna fall the wraparound boxy with a double kill. I mean credit to Nick, but you don't wanna give it up, right? You have to fight this then. This is the final game, but this is the type of game, if it was the first one in the series, you might just try and shift on to the next one to, to reset morale, but this is all you've got. Quickbook, now with the defusal on top of that Axe, 17. Oh, they're gonna go for this Roche. You've got the Axe on Snapfire. Mind control stuff as well. They're gonna get the Roche, and then they might find the Timber. Like, Tiger is pinging it. They interrupted the TP. Mind control can only waste time now. I don't even know if you care, though. If he stays here, you're happy. You just go elsewhere, because look at GH. Quick is on top of him. Balance strike interrupted the rollout, which means he's done. I'm getting a sort of flashbacks to this, uh, I think it was the TI9 Grand Finals. Oh god, this the game between now. OG and uh, <laughs> and previous Liquid now, Nygma. Oh, the, what, they just keep running at us, what do we do? <laughs> I, that's how it feels right now, uh, and I bet that's how Nygma feels too. I mean, well, that's the type of game they probably looked Dyer's back at, they, like, they dissected it and they figured it out. Hopefully they can find what, whatever findings they discover they can apply here. I mean, this lineup from Liquid though is the snowball potential. Like when these three lanes win, when these three heroes win their lanes, 
your game, it, it almost feels impossible. Miracle in trouble has to just use the stone gate to run away. The quick buff will just stand it. He said, don't worry, my reinforcements are coming. Boxy arrives, Avalanche toss there. They get the illusion instead. Miracle's still going to be chased only. The Gobelop gets rid of the rest of his mana, stunning him on the spot. They are pursuing this. Boxy diving in deeper. They're trying to turn it a quick foot, but this is only going to be his first life. Instead, Miracle, he's only got the one to work with, and he won't have it much longer. The Laguna to try and get rid of a target. They kill off Tiger, but Medusa is dead. AA is going to be chased onto next. They're rolling on a Mikke. They want to punish him, but GH needs to be careful because he will be turned upon. Mikke, they have got the damage on him. Trying to get rid of him. Insane with the save is not good enough. Mind control, find the kill. However, quick foot cleans up Wii after he comes back up from his death. GH on the back line will fall to Boxy. They do get some kills. That is to their credit here. At this stage, honest to God, if you walk away with one kill from that fight, you're happy as Nygma. I mean, that's a 4 to 2. And the uh, gold is about Radiant's even. The XP time. actually favoring Nygma there. Exactly. You're happy if you're Nygma. You can't, you can't ask for more right now. Like, you have is, to start somewhere. That was as good as it gets. And Radiant's Boxy with the SNY, he is one component away from his axe now. Oh. With the Monkey King in there. I, I don't know how you run away. I, I, I really... I think the only person who can escape is GH now. But that's not his job in this game. I mean, even mind control is just so, so easy for them to interrupt and burst him down. Radiance bottom tower has fallen. Is this where we start looking at how do they get them into the fountain again? I, I thought we'd wait is until they're at the base. Oh, okay. it, <laughs> all right, if we all farm right, an axe right, on right. GH, all right, that's step one. Build a force, but a hurricane pike, which he's doing on Miracle. That's step two. We need a four staff on Kuroki. Or Lena. So, uh, yeah, but we, you know, you're a Lena, you don't want to build it. But then, maybe, just maybe, you'll get them into your fountain in time for Insania to reload the person out of the fountain. Well, they did get the Yules on Lena. It's, well, it's a start. They do have an item now on the Lena. Fight being uh, 11. Uh, Taya, in the current meta, it's not easy being a, a post for Lena, my friend. And what is easy being a post for? Tiny. Look at this beast. Yules, Bling, Dagger. They cannot initiate on Mikke. This will backfire. The rolls off the mark. They can actually snipe out for Wii. Nice Yules interrupted, though. There's going to be another Yules to counter that. Wii, he couldn't get the combo out. The kisses are going to kill him off. They cannot even pick off one target up here. Instead, they're going to be picked apart themselves. Kuroki running away, but Boxy with the backstab. GH at least wasted time on the other side. Will finally fall. Kuro Radiant's able to TP out, but Boxy, he smells blood. Now, he sees mind control. How far do you go? I mean, you're a bristle. You feel a pretty tanky. You want to see what they do. The stone gaze is going to come out. It will at least deter them with this reload. The tower, however, is not safe as they have all arrived ready to take out this tier two. Got the eggs, got the vampire fangs, even with the five extra goose stacks. Help you. Pretty much just establishing dominance here. He is so tanky, and the lineup makes him so tanky that I'm pretty sure he could repetitively mash his face against the keyboard and still have maximum impact in this game as the Bristle. You're saying that's not what Bristle Vex players do? They do, but they have to look up occasionally for where they're clicking, right? I don't know. I, I say just, uh, you know, press press randomly on the map. In for a penny, in for a mash pound, your right? your head on the keyboard. Just Share unit control, maybe. Pray, it's like, oh, he's insane. <laughs> Just like tell Insaney he has to guide where you go, you're just going to keep mashing your head against the keyboard. And he's going for the BKB next, so then, uh... Yeah, I, I think he might be a diving tier 4 territory if we weren't already there. Now on... Hey, at... Aim very much in the hands of Liquid right now. All eyes on Miracle to know what he can do. I mean, he can't even farm. Boxy is constantly taking these stacks away from him. Oh, the jump hit the gobble! Tiger's gonna be in the Avatars as well. Miracle still got mana to work with. He's able to get the stone gears out and get out of the Wukong's command. But look how deep Boxy is. They throw everything onto this bristle and it's not enough. They're gonna lose more. 
BKB activated for Quake, but Hunt Ford on the way. He's dead as well. Foxy is full HP already. GH's rollout will be interrupted as Quake That's stays done. on top of him. They're hunting for more. They want the big one. Miracle protected by the LSA from the five back of Weaver. They're hunting in. Tiger is there again with the toss back. They say hit the GG already. We are going to massacre you non stop. Mind control, not able to move away. The gobble up, safe to interrupt the chain. It's an ultra kill for Koi Face. Says, Where's that rampage? Let me have that one. But Foxy says, No. Found help me get one instead. If you get a kill on Insane, I'd be impressed right now. Kuro with the dieback inside his own fountain. 23 minutes, 24k gold lead, 3 minutes. This, this almost like reminds me of, I think it was Alliance where before the found got changed, when Bristol would just stand in the found and tank it and kill everyone, right? Like at least we haven't got to deal with that. Any that is the one silver line Enigma have to look forward to right now, is Boxy can't forever sit in the found tank in it. Yet. You want to put the caster curse to test? Uh, that's I feel what like I said. This is... <laughs> that's what I said, yeah. This is, this is, this is, this is, I feel like this is one of those moments, you know, if, if Nigma come back and win this game, KP will eat his hat. This is easy. I don't have a hat. <laughs> I will buy a hat and ship it to you. Nice. PyCat's going to buy me a hat, folks. Either way, I'm a winner. <laughs> Till I have to eat it. Uh, I mean, I'm not going to take the, the leather shoe bet that someone done once upon a time, as I don't want to die. <laughs> Something I, can, I think Nigma can resonate with right now. Nine kills to 44. Yeah, I, I mean, they, they did come back and win the 10 to 39, but I, I feel like this is in a completely different level of, of, of advantage at this minute. This is one of those examples where, um, like, if this was if this is like low MMR, right, and, and one team had this advantage, we could talk about, oh, if you gave this to, to a pro team, they'd find a way to wiggle back into this. So maybe if we could get some sort of timeout substitute where Liquid's players get replaced by some people from Twitch chat. Miracle. They're coming. Hit the button. Run like hell. The kisses are coming for the back line. They can't quite reach Wee, but Miracle not able to move away quick enough. We'll be able to get out. TP is successful. But, I mean, that's just Liquid playing with their food right now. Cool, you get out, they say. But what's your move next? How do you punish us for trying that? 30,000. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Let's not even talk about XP. I mean, there's only one green hero in the top six. Insania is a higher level than both mind control and we. Radiance middle tower is I mean, Quake's network is almost equal to four members of Enigma. Dire structures are fortified. I know they're all in on the miracle usually, but. I don't know if going all in that basket was a good idea this time. They're going to whip the stun. Ice blast the waste. They'll just go now. Avalanche toss. One down. GH evil to get away barely. The tree is tossed after him, but it won't finish him off. Goblin, they try to snipe him out. It won't be enough, though. GH just about heals up to the point where he won't instantly die. Coming again. They say, okay, no ice blast. No stone gaze. As if we worried about those things anyway. Tiger can't get the toss out, has got the yule to stop the follow-up damage. They're trying to kill him. Look, you're into the game low. I with the reload out. They can't even get the tiny kill. That is the whole kit. That is everything you really had to throw at it. And they're still alive. Boxy tests his luck. He's got a BKB though. The Goblin up next on the wing. He's down. Avalanche toss across. Stacking him up. Miracle. He does at least have the stone gate. They will find the Insania kill. Io is down. But everything else, Enigma is down. As they're losing multiple heroes, they're losing buildings as well. Boxy may have finally gone too deep. He's staying around. The kiss is nice interrupted by GH. He will give his life to save miracles. But they won't even get Boxy. He's fine. He says, all right. They don't want to give up. It's fine. I don't know how much thousands we've got in network fleet right now, but I have to imagine it's as much as minutes passed, and they'd be right. They're 34,000 up, 27 minutes into this game. And even get the... Not even the kill on Tiger, you know? Not a, come on, you know? Not even the position before they go with it, everything. If... If Miracle, you're insane, at least Miracle, you know, he's he's trying, right? He's not that breaker, you know, he wants a shot at this. 
I don't know if it's going to be a little money. shot. But it's, it's the only move right now. Uh, if you're insane, if I mean, you, I, do you just queue up an Aeon Disc right now to make it impossible for anyone to die? I just want to see the game go long enough for the dudes to at least get to buy the rapier. That would be that would be nice. I mean, I remember I said I I, I made jinx that I said to the chat tier five I am game incoming. Liquid, they thought about that and then said hell no. At this rate, it doesn't look like this game is going to last all that much longer. Now the ages and I can already hear Mortal Kombat announcer screaming finish him. They might come for the finish and blow now. Miracle has got fire back, of course, because the same with that rapier, but if he has to fire back, it's all but done. Gonna be slowed down, trying to move away with the spider legs, down a half mana already. Boxy's now arrived, he's in trouble. Does get the stone gaze out for the cookie. Nice dodge out with the Manta, goes for the TP away. Will be successful. Who are they gonna lose though? Kuro able to TP as well. We is gonna be hard not to box you with the BKB still go. We'll be looking for that kill. Stun will come out just in time. The ice blast through trying to punish it, but Tiger jumping in with a toss back. They found Miracle again. He thought he was out, but now he's in the mess once more. Wu comes through. The kiss has followed up as well. Miracle being brought low. He's out alive. He's gonna fall. Has got a buyback. But I wanna commit it, but it might be over anyway. Boxy tanking the fountain. Will find another kill. He will not even die to that. Holy Mary, mother of Moses. This game. It's a 40,000 net worth lead. About 30 minutes in. Liquid, they're gonna force it finally. GG comes out. Nigma will look back at this one and wonder was there even an iota of hope after that fight in the river at the zero minute mark. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this is just kind of funny.